Now at five, a teenager is in some pretty serious trouble for playing doctor at a South Florida medical facility. And it's not the first time police say he did it. CBS 4's Elliot Rodriguez is here now with the details. Erica, police say the 17 year old pretended to be an anesthesiologist. He wore a white coat with a stethoscope around his neck and walked around the hospital pretending to be a doctor for an entire month. Detectives do not explain what motivated the teenager to pose as a doctor at St. Mary's Medical Center in West Palm Beach. According to the incident report, staff members inside the OBGYN office were alerted by a patient that a young black male who appeared to be a child was dressed as a doctor. Police say the individual was a 17-year-old teenager. St. Mary's notes the OBGYN office is not part of the hospital, but an outpatient clinic on the medical center campus. The report says multiple people saw the teen walking around the hospital for about one month pretending to be a doctor. And police say surveillance video inside St. Mary's shows him walking around the hospital wings, but never entering any rooms or seeing any patients. I'm surprised with all the security here, you can't even smoke out in the parking lot without security catching you. And you have to show ID to get into the hospital. I'm very surprised somebody made it that far. St. Mary's released a statement on January 13th, an individual was detained by security at St. Mary's Medical Center after falsely presenting himself as a physician. The individual never had contact with any hospital patients and did not gain access to any patient care areas of the hospital at any time. The hospital immediately notified local authorities who took the individual into custody and we are cooperating with their ongoing investigation. The safety and security of patients is our highest priority. West Palm Beach police say no crime was committed and the teen who posed as a doctor is not under arrest. Hard to believe. Now the teen's mother told police her son was suffering from an undisclosed illness and was under the care of a real doctor but was not taking his medication. Elliot Rodriguez, CBS 4 News. Elliot, thank you very much. Duke